Des Little. Good solid clearance there by McNally. Little in again. The chance for McFarlane. Yes! Andy McFarlane. One nothing Swansea. Leg going down the left touch line. Gets away from Raymond. Looks for a quality cross now. And yes, it is Martin Hayes. There's Donovan. Nally again. Looking for the cross in. Freestone has to get there. Didn't. Off the bar in the net. As he got that ball in. Just stretched out. Got a toe in to it. And it comes down off McFarland. You can't blame McFarland for that. But well, what ha whatever happens tonight, Trevor, you, you must be satisfied that back in May last year, you made the right decision in picking Oziades and beat Keith Bergenshaw as the management team for the Hawthorns. That's right, yes. We knew that uh, when we took over last May that we were going to have a difficult job on our hands. And uh, we wanted to bring some professionalism back to West Brom. And uh, we couldn't think of uh, a finer pair than Ozzy and Keith. On the playing front, the manager has brought in seven players for around £400,000. All seven have been successes, especially, say, Steve Lilwall, Ian Hamilton and Kevin Donovan. You must have faith with Ozzy by giving him club money on, the, with, on his track record. Well, obviously, uh, Keith and Ozzy together, they, they look at a lot of players over a year and they told us who they want and uh, they've sorted them out. Um, obviously, funds have been tight, but they've worked within the budget we've given them. I think the buyers have been superb and... Um, we're, we're, we're looking forward to tonight's game with the thought that if we're going to Division 1, obviously we've got to give them some more money to buy even better players. You've gone on record as saying players like Bob Taylor will not be sold. Now, what would the situation be if, say, £2 million was offered for him? How much? £2 million. £2 million, well, I have to say it's not enough. Um, if we get promoted and we're going to be a Division 1 side, we've got to buy the likes of Bob Taylor and not sell them. And uh, I made a promise to the fans at the beginning of the season that when I took over as chairman that I would not sell our better players. Um, I, I sincerely mean that and uh, Bob hasn't uh, got an earthly chance of moving from here for whatever money. And finally Trevor, what are your hopes and aspirations for the future of West Bromwich Albion Football Club? To see us back in that Super League and to be playing some of the Manchester United and Tottenham Hotspurs here like we used to when we were at the top of our division the last time and uh, I hope it's not going to be too long to wait for everybody's sake. McNally, Raven is with him. McNally elects to chip it in. Taylor was rising. It fell to Andrew Legg. Hamilton. That's a great ball. Donovan's little header. This is Taylor. Puts it in. It's an equaliser. Aggregate's equaliser by Andy Hunt. 1-0 on the night. Andy Hunt gets the goal. Jeff. Brilliant. Brilliant finish. Bob Taylor made the goal, crossed it hard and low, and there was Hunt at the end of it. I mean, he scored some great goals for us this season. Uh, I mean, a brilliant start for us. I think if we can now, you know, just slow things down a little bit. But it was a brilliant finish. Taylor is trying to return it. Hamilton with the footing. Now Taylor's through. Oh, and it's. But past the post by Freestone, there was suddenly a great awe of expectation then, and it didn't quite come. No, it was, it was certainly a good chance there for Bob to, to score there, but I don't. I think he tried to place it in the corner. I think he'd be better off blasting it from where it was and hoping for the best. Freestone in trouble again. Yeah! Ian Hamilton has made it 2-0 on the night. The Swansea marking vanished and Hamilton had a clean, clean sight of goal and he made no mistake. <laughs> That's it. West Bromwich Albion goes to Wembley in the playoff final. Sorry for Swansea, really. they played well, they fought their hearts out, just didn't come up in their night. The story of it all, two goals in the first half by Andy Hunt and Ian Hamilton, ascending off of Mickey Mellon.
the sending off of Colin West. A 3-2 aggregate win, and West Bromwich Albion 